already know. We gonna be the Terminator. And we got a back bling. Elim. Very, very catchy Fortnite. Aim and Elim. This outfit's looking kind of tough. I'm not gonna lie. The back bling uh, displays the number of Elims you have. We'll see if we can get a few and show you what it looks like in game. We're using the AC DC pickaxe. I just feel like there's some current running through my man right now. And the Mako glider. And um, of course the glitch in the system. So enjoy the gameplay and the showcase. It's a weird flex, but okay. That's a weird flex, but okay, Pizzo, you nerd. Go into Pizzo Palms. Guys, we've been talking about this on the live stream for about the past two weeks. We're looking into making a Pizzo Palms t-shirt because we always land here. Maybe like a like an old GTA Vice City, Vice City vibe. So um, I'll let you guys know if that ends up um, being something you guys can purchase if you're interested. Something cool, just like an 80s design, Pizzo Palms. Because we always come here. It's become like a, a part of the stream, actually. All right, give me that burst. My burst have been doo, doo lately, so I will kindly drop that. That AK is rocking over there. This outfit would be a lot more relative to me if it showed how many times I got revived. That's just it. Maybe you can have the option for that, Fortnite. How many times you get revived you can display on the back. Oh, God. You. You. My man, you coming up? Be scared now. That was, uh... Almost didn't make it. Almost didn't make it, guys. We have a one on our back. It does work, guys. It works. Two elims. All right. So I wonder how... F I'm sure it goes, like, to double digits. So I wouldn't worry about that. Because, you know, I'd be dropping double digits like every game anyway, so it's not really a big deal. I mean, I'll see it all the time, but you guys might not, you know? <laughs> I'm not going to go through a full gameplay, guys, but I will give you some ADS, just kind of show you what it looks like in-game. And then we'll show you some combos that uh, are going to match my man Aim over here. And then we'll give it a rating. your toes i thought because you know i'd be dropping double digits like every game anyway so it's not really a big deal all right guys so this is aim without a back bling i kind of like it because you can see his spine it looks like the um the chain to a gatling gun in a sense his spine it was pretty cool uh there's a lot of detail on it i know it's a bit bulky a lot of people don't like bulky outfits but i'm kind of digging it guys i didn't think i was when i saw you know leaks here and there but i'm kind of digging it so I took the liberty of picking a few back blings I thought looked pretty cool with aim. I'm not going to show all of them. I don't want to waste too much of your time, guys, because some of them don't match. And it's not even worth. So there's some cool combos. And I did pick some back blings that will be super bulky and make the character even more bulky than it already is. 
But I think it just kind of fits, you know? It's really not that disturbing because his waist is really skinny. So it kind of bounces out his, his really thick legs and his, you know, his shoulders and his back. Um, so I'm, I'm not too upset about this outfit. This might be the best, you know, reward skin we've gotten from weekly challenges, in my opinion. There's a lot going on here. You can't take away the fact of all the details going on. I mean, you, you got like the... Let's look at his legs, man. His legs are clean. This matches really well. Actually, Fish Tank usually don't like it. But there's a lot of detail going on. I don't know what the significance of 30 is on his legs. Maybe someone's going to crack the case and do some myth busting, but I don't know. Care package, super bulky. But nonetheless, still kind of goes with it. Deep fried is troll. I like it. Now, I tried Ghost Portal with the green, but since he does have blue on him, I went with blue instead. The gurney gear is... Eh. It's all right, bulky as well, steel cast. This just ties in with it. You would, you might think this is part of the outfit. It is a little more shiny than the rest of it. It's got a little bit more gloss going on, but it's still pretty cool. Tag bag, because it's silver, we had to. Airflow, same reason. Squire shield, I really like this shield. I'll use it on as many outfits as I can stretch it. Very cool, and vintage. I just thought it looked cool like he was going to school, like robot school, Terminator school. Um, so what back me looked best on AIM over here? I really like Sinclair. Um, the black shield and the red shields are very cool because he has enough going on already that something simple on his back looks really pleasing to my eyes. But I liked Steel Cast a lot. Steel Cast looked really cool to me. So I've had some time to think, guys, and I think the reason why I'm kind of drawn to this outfit now that I've used it is because it reminds me of like the NFL robots. You guys know what I mean? Like on the commercials and the pregame and stuff. Um, so I'm giving it an 8 out of 10, man. The backlink is cool. It's kind of the first of its kind where it's it's tallying how many elims you have as you're playing the game. I thought they missed out on an opportunity with the NFL skins. I thought it would have been really cool to have the first down markers show your elims. Because usually it's one one through four on the NFL first down markers. And if you show your elims on those, I think it'd be a really, really good idea. Like I said, we use ACDC because the it just looks like it, it goes with in the Mako. So an 8 out of 10, guys, for sure on AIM. I'm digging it. So with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya!